Welcome to Chalk Mountain Golf Course, par 72, blue tee 6,299 yards, and the course rating is 70.5. Today we'll be playing all 18 holes, we'll be tracking all 18 holes of myself and every shot that I took. My playing partners today is Don Hedrick, Owen, and Rex. So, as we go through, I'll be watching along. I got my cup of tea here with me, and I'll be giving you a little course voiceover giving a little uh, backstory to it. So let's join on hole number one, par five, 531 yards. Here's the drone flyover. And it's looking pretty nice conditions today. It was sunny, probably 72 degrees. We teed off, I believe, 8.30 in the morning or so. So a nice morning round. And I hit it left on the tee shot. And then I hit it right on my approach shot towards the green. Now I'm chipping here for four. I chip it here and it just rolls past the pin. And now I have a little chip shot and it's a little too far. So now I got a tough little grinder for par or for bogey. It's a little left to right and it's down the hole. I take a sip of tea as we go into hole two, par four, 357 yards. Here's Don's tee shot, a nice high draw. We got the shot tracker following today. I chose the nice pink bright tracker and I hit a nice bomb straight down the fairway. End up in the rough but that hole works. Hit a wedge onto the green and then here's a bomb. Yeah, hit a huge baby. putt right there. That was probably 40 feet for birdie. Get in. Oh, and Owen makes a birdie of his own. Two birdies. So now on to hole three, par three, 194 yards. I believe on this hole, I take a six iron, try and hit a fade, and I just push it a little bit and it's heading towards, and it's safe. In between the bunker and the hazard, I hit this nice high 60 degree shot and it lands within basically gimme range, about two feet. Gotta make all those though. Hole four, par four, 352 yards. Hazard left, so you want to stay away from that. Right is safe. Hazard, no good. So I try to hit a draw and I push fade it way out to the right. Right. Safety first though. Take a pitching wedge from about 130 yards, I believe, 120 yards. And it's a little bit too much. So I have a long putt and I blast it. Zooms by the hole. So here's for par right to left and I miss it and we'll tap that in for bogey and here's a nice putt by Rex That's nice hole five par three 173 yards I believe I take a six iron here and again I'm trying to hit a fade and I push fade it what do you know heavy rough Try to hit a 60 degree on there and just leave it a little short. Here is a tough putt right to left on one of the hardest greens and bang, drain it. That's two bombs. That was a great par save there. Now hole six, par five, 470 yards, par five. Number one handicap of the course, uphill, dog leg right, trees left and right. And what do you know? Trying to hit a draw and hit another push fade. That is common theme for me as you can see I got to get up and down here oh, wait no actually that was up and down for birdie so now I'll be putting here for birdie it's a long birdie putt give it a chance I thought I had it didn't turn as much as I thought and I has have a tap in par there you go good par hole seven par three 154 yards Magnificent par three. Middle pin today. I believe I'd take a nice easy eight iron, hit a fade, and it actually worked this time. Good shot there. Don had a great shot too. A little long. Now here's my birdie putt. This is a left to right big slider. I had a great line, just a little bit too much pace there. And I'll clean up nicely for par. 
Moving on to hole number eight, par four, 337 yards. This will be a driver. And this is a pretty easy hole, pretty open off the tee. And I hit a nice uh, high shot. And there was some wind up there and really all of our tee shots here were pretty short compared to usual. Here's Don shot. Nice drive there by Don. And then here's my second shot. Nice 60 degree, probably from about 55 yards, 60 yards, and I just don't get it there. Here's my birdie putt. Give it a go. Just misread it a little bit, and I'll have a nice tap in par. Now hole nine, par four, 415 yards. This is a tough uphill, long par four, dog leg left, uphill the whole way. So I'll take driver off the tee. I had a nice driver shot, a little bit right, and it's actually a little long, so I have to hit a big fade around these trees. And I hit a beautiful fade, take a little extra club. I think I just hit it a little bit too hard, and it goes over the green in this really tough position. It actually took me a while to find it. I got it, handed Don the camera for this camera work right here, and hit a great shot out. It was a brutal lie. So I'm trying to make this par putt and just barely misread it. Leave it a little low on the left. Tap in for bogey. Hope you're enjoying these drone shots. This is hole number 10, par five, 520 yards downhill, trees left and right. You can get in a lot of trouble on this hole. I take a nice little baby punch three wood. Beautiful. I slowed down my tempo here and this one worked out really well. Same thing again, bomb this three wood as well. Heads just right over the car path and goes just short of the bunker. Oh yeah. Well done. A couple highlights from Owen and Don. Now here's my chip up to the green. A little bit to the right, but it's a nice tempo, nice little shot there. Now this putt is for birdie. A nice little birdie. Now moving on to hole number 11, par four, 318 yards. Got the hazard on the right that forces you to hit iron off the tee. Short little iron hybrid of three wood. So I take a three iron, try to hit a nice little baby fade. A little bit to the right of what I wanted, but it stays up and it's safe. So here I have a nice 52 degree from I think 115 yards and I hit it on the money. Here's my birdie putt, it's left the whole way. Never gave it a chance and tap in par. Hole 12, par four, 333 yards. This one, it's kind of dog leg right. You can hit driver off the tee or iron lay it up short. I go ahead and take driver, try to hit a fade around the corner, kind of almost sky, it hits the tree and I'm watching it and it's well short of what I wanted but doesn't go all the way into the hazard. I have a tough lie and boom, no. I skull it over the green, thinking it's 50 yards over. Hill stops it, hit a chip that just goes way too far. And now this putt is for par. And what do you know? <laughs> Splendid, pleasing, marvelous shot there. Now hole 13, this one's a doozy. Par four, 406 yards. This is the hardest hole on the course. Uphill, blind second shot. Beautiful view here though. I had a nice three wood off the tee. Absolutely bombed. Here's a nine iron. Uphill from about 140 yards. Hit this one way off the toe. Probably didn't take enough club. Leave it way, well short. Chip shot, pulled it. Good distance control though. Here's a puff. That was for par. Slammed it in. Money. Making some of those par putts today. It's good stuff so far. Hole 14, par 3, 134 yards. This one, teaser up a little bit. I believe here I take a pitching wedge. And... No, this was actually... I had a 52 degree there. Miss hit it a little bit. Spun it back. Long birdie putt. Par putt. And finish it up. Par. Hole 15, par 5, 463 yards. Easiest hole on the course. I call this the daily dono... The daily donation. Gotta make birdie every time on a short par five like this one. 
night, Tristan. The miss is that tree, you're over. Now here's a four iron. Just leave this one out to the right, a little short. And here is a beautiful pitch shot here. Get it high up in the air, carry it almost all the way there. It almost looks like it goes in. Goes just past the pen for a nice tap in birdie. Daily donation confirmed. Hole 16, par three, 221 yards. This is a long par three, hazard left. Tough hole here, very tough hole. This is uh, the hardest par three, I would say. Take a three iron on this hole usually. This one I miss hit this one bad. Left it, I chunked it, but kept it in play. Chipped it up, left it short too. Putt for par, never gave it a chance. And tap and bogey. My favorite hole in the course, hole 17, par five, 567 yards. Huge dog leg left. It probably bends directly to the left and you can cut over the corner here. Be really safe you can go straight or you can cut 30 20 30 40 yards over these trees but you, as you see I do not take advantage of that push it way out to the right but it's safe now here I have three wood apart from about 260 yards downhill into the bunker I take a 52 degree try to hit a nice shot out of the bunker but leave it short so now here's for birdie Birdie putt tracking, just a little left, and there's a tap in par. Now, the hole number 18, uphill par 4, 354 yards, kind of a blind tee shot. Just got to keep it right of these trees. Pretty open, take driver, and push it out to the right. Seems to be a common theme today. But I have these trees, I got to hit a little punt shot, grab a 4 iron, and it's a Beautiful punt shot from about 100 yards, 120 yards. I putt for birdie. I give this one a go because we're playing a match and this was to win the match, but we ended up winning anyways. Three putt on the last hole, and that ends me up with a 74. Well, thank you for watching this course vlog shot for shot video at the beautiful Chalk Mountain Golf Course. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.